Good day there viewers and welcome to my channel. My name is Cliff. I'm a gem cutter from Southern Australia. I live in the state of Victoria and usually I make videos about how to cut gemstones. Today me and my friend will be going on a field trip. Not that far from where I live but I had the opportunity to go to an area of Victoria called Corop which is well known to have Jasper. Now I've been to Corop many a times when I was younger with my father. He was a real rock hound. He enjoyed coming to this district looking for Jasper because he loved making cabochons. He would have literally made hundreds of cabochons of Jasper from Corop. Now you're going to see some of the biggest outcrops of Jasper that you'll probably ever see. We only pick up a little bit. We're not greedy and fortuitously where we go the road has been sort of ploughed over to make a fire break so it's easy pickings unfortunately it's pretty windy today so you may need to turn the volume down because the microphone was picking up everything let's see if you can find some banding in some of them yeah i think that's going to have a lot of air holes in it yeah well just discard it but uh See how that's just quite fortuitous that they've graded up the road for us, which is good. Here's a bit of red jasper. Look at that one, it's got some nice banding in it. That's a nice beef there. Yeah, that's a nice one. Check that one out. Look at that for a massive piece of jasper. Right behind you. <laughs> you can't yeah. see if you can't see that. Huh? <laughs> That's something wrong. Take that home with you, Merv. Yeah, That's massive. Look at the size of it. Yeah. Oh, there's a big chunk. Is there bees there? Yeah, bees in the tree. Oh, good. Oh, I won't go there. Yeah. Look at this big chunk of jasper. But over there, the one behind you, check that out. Yeah. Look at that.
red piece. It's hmm? a nice bright red piece. Yeah, that is it. Grab that bit down there. Let's see it. Nice. You gonna grab this one, eh? Yeah, you wanna grab it for me? Yeah. That looks okay. Yeah, it looks alright. Yeah. Oh, too greedy. I don't need a huge bowl. It's a little bit fine. start to show up. No, it That's a nice interesting piece, I reckon. So if you've made it this far into the video, this is what I call the final reveal. Often the final reveal is usually about one of the gems that I've faceted. However, in this case, I'm showing you what I've found on my field trip to Karop. Now I would have loved to have stayed a lot longer on this field trip, but unfortunately, as you could hear in the video, there was a lot of wind and then later on it blew up a storm and started to rain and it was time to pull the pin on the field trip and go home. But I wouldn't have taken too much more than this. I was hoping to find a little bit of green and red with banding, but I do love the red jasper from Karop. It really makes really nice cabochons. 
in a moment you're going to see what this jasper looks like sliced up so as you see a really nice piece of red jasper don't discard it because it will make some really nice cabochon material and here it is so I'm getting closer to the end of another video and a lot of my subscribers and viewers ask me to make these videos because they like to see Australian content they like to see a little bit of nature as I'm driving along and of course see what type of rocks and minerals we have available in Australia now this video is quite rough and raw uh, the weather conditions were not very good but it is what it is I only take my camera and I don't have a budget of half a million dollars or I don't drag along a film crew so I've got to put up with what nature offers me and sometimes it can be quite cruel today was one of those days but I hope you enjoy this video and until next time take care and I will see you in the next video it's bye for now see you later